On this date in Missouri Senate history, the date was September 25th, 1969, tenth day of the first extra session of the first regular session of the 75th General Assembly. This was a Thursday with 31 senators present and three absent with leave. Out of the gate, messages from the House would reveal Senate Bill 1 had received approval. This measure related to the state income tax, one of four items on the docket for lawmakers during this extra session. The Missouri House of Representatives had added three amendments to this proposal, which could eventually set up a conference committee if the Missouri Senate refuses to accept these amendments. This was followed by a reading House Concurrent Resolution 3, which offered formation of a joint committee to look into ways to raise revenue in our state. Missouri, much like the rest of the country, was in the midst of a recession. The extra session was called in part to raise taxes and find other ways to bring revenue into the state. The panel would meet before the start of the next General Assembly, which would mean holding hearings during the 1970 interim between May 1970 and January 1971. After this, Senators took up Senate Bill 1 and approved it with all three House amendments. Senators then moved to House Bill 1 and then House Bill 2 before a recess until 2 p.m. More work would resume on House Bill 2 in the afternoon. The measure would be set aside for further consideration. Senators continued into the afternoon and moved to adjourn until 2 p.m. the following Tuesday, which would also be the final day of this extra session. September 25, 1969, the date marking day 10 of the first extra session of the first regular session of the 75th General Assembly on this date in Missouri Senate history.